Hey guys, what's going on? It's Osas here with iPhone Hacks, and I'm going to be showing you the new features of tvOS 9.2 Beta 1. So, there's not a whole lot here to show you guys, but there are some much needed improvements, and one of those is creating folders. So, in order to create a folder, you tap and hold on an app, and you can drag it over onto another app that you would like to create a folder with, like so. Drop it in there, and then you can change the name if you would like or proceed as usual. You can also add a new folder by tapping and holding once more. So let's try it with HBO Go. Tap and hold once in toggle mode. You hit the play button on the Siri remote and here you'll see where it says new folder or I could move it to the games folder if it were a game. So I can click on that. It'll create a new folder and then I could go on and add more apps as I would like. The next thing they added was an updated um, app switcher, so it's going to be a lot more similar to what you would find in iOS 9. So if you double tap the home button, it'll bring you to the app switcher, which is tiled and layered, just as you would see on um, your iOS device, whereas before it was kind of a big preview of the current app, and then you would switch to other apps um, by swiping left and right. This is just much more familiar and a feature that actually some people question why wasn't it in there in the first place. There's also added support for languages for Siri so if you wanted to check that out go to general Siri and you'll see languages they've added support for uh, Canada, Australia, UK English, Spanish, French Canadian as well um, so if you wanted to mess with those you could go, go ahead and add that there They've also um, updated the map kit. This is for developers that, of course, want to add mapping functions to their apps. They can now do so. You won't see the effects of that immediately, but um, if you look out for apps being added in the future, you can definitely uh, check that out. There's also podcast, which you can actually play right from your Apple TV. I know a lot of people are now into podcast after watching Serial. By watching, I mean listening to Serial. Um, you can see here, ML MLK has his own thing in celebration of MLK Day on this Monday. So check it out. The podcast is really cool. And then there's also added support for keyboards. I don't know why this wasn't there in the first place, but um, you can now add a keyboard specifically to your remotes and devices instead of just a phone or another Bluetooth device. You could do this in all the other Apple TVs, so I guess they just figured they missed that one, so they added it to this tvOS 9.2 update. So, of course, it makes it way easier to type um, on your Apple TV. So those are the newest features in tvOS 9.2 Beta 1. Uh, make sure to check that out. You will need a developer's account to download it and check out those new features. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button. And also make sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos just like this. Alright guys, peace.